What's up guys? I think I have a really cool video for you today. I'm going to be reviewing the big e-commerce platforms of today. Uh, that is Wix, Shopify, WooCommerce, BigCommerce, Magento, and OpenCart. I'm going to be reviewing all these, providing the drawbacks, the pros and cons, all that good stuff. So uh, before I begin and giving you, giving, you all, giving you all this content, I just want to ask that you please subscribe to my channel. Hit that big red subscribe button. It helps me out more than you know. Without further ado, let's get straight into the video. First, let's go over Wix. Now, Wix is a fantastic uh, platform where you can uh, create really nice looking uh, landing pages or stunning online stores as their website puts it. I think that's their, th that's their strength in creating really nice looking landing pages and it's simple to use. One of the drawbacks to Wix, however, is that it's not very customizable. So, you know, if you want to provide, you know, complex, if you have a complex e-commerce solution or you want to provide custom options to the user, Wix may not be for you. I think that's the main drawback. Obviously, there, there are some other things, but I think that's the main things. You know, cut, cut, uh, customizing your website because you have to pick a theme and there are certain things that you have to abide by to use Wix. Now Shopify. If you want to do Shopify dropshipping or if you just want to do dropshipping in general, Shopify is the way to go. That's what I think that's its real strength and that's why it's really picked up steam and that's why it's doing so well. Shopify is doing great right now just because of Shopify dropshipping. So if that's what you're watching this video for, choose Shopify. Highly recommended. Shopify is great for starting a, a, a you know a great looking simple e-commerce store. It does provide good functionality, but I think in some ways it could be improved. It provides amazing analytics and a great user interface. Uh, you can create a very nice looking e-commerce theme in you know little to no time. I think that's what it, it's it's really great uh, to uh, to make a simple e-commerce website. For WooCommerce, if you are using WordPress and want to integrate e-commerce into your existing website, uh, WooCommerce is the way to go. I think it's as simple as that and that's what it's built for. I don't think there's much more that needs to be said. BigCommerce. I haven't used BigCommerce a whole lot, but what I can say is it's similar to Shopify in that it has similar features and I think that they are very similar so you can sort of choose between them. Uh, BigCommerce is very simple to set up. Um, it has similar pricing. Uh, you know, it's it, analytics are great and all that. Um, if you want to do Shopify dropshipping, dropshipping again, choose Shopify. Uh, I, I, one of the other reasons I would choose Shopify over Big Commerce is that you know Shopify has some great uh, plugins or add-ons and apps that you can sort of integrate to your to your website. So in most cases, I would recommend Shopify over Big Commerce. Magento. Magento is a very robust and powerful e-commerce platform and in most cases Magento, you know, it's, it's just a way to go but Magento can be very expensive with its enterprise platforms costing, you know, twenty to thirty thousand dollars. So it can be very expensive. If you want a very scalable way to launch an e-commerce store and you're perhaps an, you're an enterprise or, you know, a big business or even just a regular business that is scaling, you, uh, Magento is probably the way to go for you, especially if you need, you know, a customized store with great support. Open cart. Open cart is very customizable. It's free, which I think is one of the best parts in open source. And if you want to integrate into perhaps your existing website, uh, open cart is probably the way to go for you. It is pretty powerful, but it lacks uh, customer service and support. It doesn't have great support. So that is one of the drawbacks of OpenCart. But overall, OpenCart is very customizable. But if you were, if you don't have a lot of coding experience or you're new to e-commerce, uh, OpenCart may be hard for you. So really quick to sum everything I've talked about in this video, Wix create a beautiful landing page with a simple e-commerce back uh, back end integrated into it. Shopify, especially for Shopify dropshipping, uh, very easy to set up and um, a simple e-commerce, a simple great looking e-commerce site uh, you can make with Shopify. WooCommerce is for integrating with your existing WordPress store. BigCommerce, create a simple uh, store just like Shopify, but usually Shopify is the way to go. Magento, robust, powerful, but expensive. OpenCart, very uh, free, open source, customizable, but sometimes difficult to set up, and with that, not much support. 
So that is sort of all of these summed up. I hope you enjoyed this video. I really, uh, you know, enjoyed researching and uh, trying all these out. I've used most of these in the past. Open Card I've used for a client as well as WooCommerce, uh, you know, for integrating with WordPress. I've also used Shopify, obviously for Shopify drop shipping. Uh, Wix for uh, um, a landing page. I haven't really used the e-commerce end of it, however. And um, I had not used Magento, although I've worked with someone who has used Magento, and I've set up a sample store for big commerce to see how it is. So that's sort of my experience with these platforms. Overall, all great stuff. I hope you enjoyed this video, and have a great day.